exactly what are these bivalent vaccines and how different are they from the ones that we had uh, in the last two years? Okay, the, the original version is uh, made up of Wuhan strain, the original strain, original. the prototype strain that we call. So itong bivalent, monovalent yung una. So the, the bivalent, the, as the name implies, it has two components. So the first one is the Wuhan strain, half of it, and then either B1, Omicron B.1, or B Omicron B45. Mm -hmm. Yon. So the, the advantage is that the circulating variant now is Omicron. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, what are we looking at for this bivalent uh, vaccines? Uh, is there going to be a, a, a priority list as well? And uh, yes. will it be the same kind of priority list as before? Yeah, definitely there will be prioritization again. So we start with the healthcare workers, so A1, A2, and A3. So basically the ones who are most vulnerable to getting COVID, especially you know, in the light of this, uh, some variants uh, circulating. Mm -hmm. So... Um, the DOS should be able to come up with guidelines soon so that by the time the supplies come in, which we hope by early next year, then we, we know who to give these vaccines to. So not everybody. Mm. Well, not everybody yet. Or is that not everybody at all? Uh, uh, I mean, uh, I asked... Yet, yet siguro. We, we, we cannot say at all. <laughs> Usually, we, we have to wait. There could be some data that will be coming in so we can reassess, we evaluate what's happening. And then depending on the supplies, for all you know, the Omicron may be... Uh, ano ba yan? Um, overtaken again no, by something else. Mm. We hope not. 